Welcome back everyone to some more Age of Calamity. Let's go ahead and get this going here at the foresty area. Uh, let's see. I want to switch it out. We'll keep Link because we do need some sort of high caliber level of strength. Uh, experience plus seven percent. So this would be enough to get Link up a level. All right. Oh, cutscene. Are you certain of this? Yes. Zelda's next birthday will mark the date of Calamity Ganon's return. Yes. That is what the images we recovered indicate, at least. Time has run out. Zelda. You and the knights will travel to the Spring of Courage. No matter what it takes, you must awaken your power before Calamity returns. Understood. Records derived from the Friendly Guardian indicated that Calamity Ganon would return on Zelda's 17th birthday. Desperate to preempt this grim future, King Rome ordered his daughter to train at the Spring of Courage. The King, Princess Zelda, and every living being in Hyrule could sense the thunderous footsteps of a looming scourge. Okay, so hang on. Probably another cutscene. As I am right now, even if all I have to give is my faith that things will work out, this is the thread that I have been following all this time. Even so, all of the research into the relics I cannot awaken to my power will have been in vain. Everyone else is carrying out their duties with such grace. Why not? Let's go take a break somewhere. I've got really, um, suddenly I'm really hungry. Beautiful. It's just one more time. These boys just don't quit. Monsters here. Hmm. In any case, all we can do is push them back. Man, you don't want this. So what? Where is the Triforce? I'm wondering. Like, oh wow, wrong button. You know, I wonder where the Triforce is because is Zelda's power something different than the Triforce? Because at the end of Breath of the Wild, it looked like she summons the Triforce, like the whole thing. But at the same time, why would that be so difficult to figure out how to control? Since she, uh, since like Ganondorf gets the Triforce, he knows exactly how to use it immediately. And if you have the whole Triforce, you're able to make a, a wish. Like that's that's been the whole deal with it, unless Breath of the Wild just completely retconned that and 
changed it to where the Triforce is now a Zelda only thing and it doesn't grant wishes anymore. I mean, that could be possible. Be, that'd suck if that was actually what it is. It's just, it's kind of weird. Like, Zelda has all this hidden power. But like I've said, I'm hoping we see uh, I'm hoping we see the Triforce in the next game, and not just like at the very end. I hope we actually see the Triforce play a pivotal role, and not just uh, the Sheikah slate and everything. No, come here. I gotta kill you. You must die so that I can have your power. What? Oh, th there. Okay, I was like, where's the ice cubes? The monsters keep coming. Everyone stay focused. Don't worry about me. Princess, I appreciate your valor. But if things get bad, save yourself. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let me go to one of the actual areas. We need to get an outpost. Running in the rain. Oh, God. Screw you guys. Oh, forget it. Actually, hold on. Let me, uh... Let's get this guy over here. Go ahead and win us a outpost over there, would you? Come on. See, so does ice do anything to you? Nope. Okay, so that's what that means. I was trying to think. I didn't know if it meant ice was their weakness or if they were immune to ice. And it is the latter of the two. What we got in these crates? You know, I kind of wonder, what would a Breath of the Wild style game be like? with a Twilight Princess style art. Because, you know, this is a cool art style and I like it and everything, but it's definitely... It's definitely leaning more on the cartoony side of things. Not, It's not quite as cartoony as Wind Waker, but it's still fairly cartoony. Whereas Majora's... Or not Majora's Mask. Twilight Princess was the like most realistic out of all of them. Followed by Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Skyward Sword also had a bit of a cartoony look to it. Like I've said, I've never actually played Skyward Sword because the one time I bought the game, I was sold a demo and took it back and never got around to playing or getting the actual game. But I've seen plenty of footage of the game, so I, I pretty much know what's going on. Uh... But it also had a bit of a cartoon-like art style to it. So I wonder if um, we're ever going to see another Zelda game that's got more of a realism to it. Not like super realistic, but Twilight Princess realistic. That, that'd be really cool to see again. And they said this is going to, they say Twilight, or not Twilight, they say Breath of the Wild 2 is going to be one of the darker Zelda games. Oh man, I can't open this, I have to...
Can I jump off? Okay. Alright, let me get this outpost over here. I refuse to fall. I mean, you're, you're, you're doing good with help. You're, you're cool. Oh, it's a fire moblin. Yeah, you highly allergic to the ice of... Alright, so we got that outpost. Now let's go to the last one. got to just screw off with y'all's attacks. Yes. Destruction. Alright. Man, there's so many of these guys. They're just everywhere. See that pathway is this one over here. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, it's this one. Never mind. Thought I was going the wrong way for a second. No! Gosh, they pop up so quickly before you can actually hit the backflip button to dodge. All right, I'm here to help. Daruk, don't die on me. I love how we have no reinforcements whatsoever. It's just us three. That should put an end to the monsters. Yeah, got that right, Impa. I love having full health. Wait a minute. There's monsters near the princess. Wait a minute, there's all these monsters. All three of us just abandoned the princess. How stupid are we? You would think one of us would stay behind and like keep watch with the princess. Not. Yeah, there's like a thousand of these guys. Let's just all back away from the princess. Are we about to have like a freaking princess peach moment and like what's his face? Kidnaps her the Koga Yiga clan member. So what is your, uh, is fire y'all's weakness? Doesn't really make sense. Oh man, screw you, you moblin. Finally, the monster inclusion have quit. All right, so what do we got? Oh, Zelda, no, you glitched. You're, okay, the chest freed you. All right, new objective, help Zelda escape. Okay, so it's raining outside. I wonder if we're getting near the end of this, like... Well, no, no, because this isn't Zelda's 17th birthday or whatever. Unless that's a false... That, that could be false. I don't know. 
I'm trying to think what the cutscene was like when it was raining that time when Zelda unlocks her power. But I don't think that would be the same night. Because I'm pretty sure that... Yeah, yeah, that's not the same night because... Um, the champions all go to their Divine Beast in the daytime. And we haven't done that yet. I was thinking we were about to play as the Divine Beast, or not the Divine Beast, but the champions go into their uh, Divine Beast in the rain, but that doesn't happen in that story. In Breath of the Wild, the cutscenes that we see, they head to their Divine Beast when Calamity Ganon comes out. And that's when uh, they ultimately will die, but we don't get to see that. A sea of trees, I wonder if we toppled them, perhaps they'll block the way. Alright, so where are these trees that I need to, like, chop down? Or wait, do I need a... Haha! -ha. They can't come in and I can't come back out. Oh my god. Screw off. Every one of y'all. See, I need to go over here and help. Where's the other tree? Oh, hey, we got a treasure chest. Diamonds. Man, this really makes me want to play some Breath of the Wild. Like, It's a fun... Now, I'm hoping Breath of the Wild 2... And I may have said this already in another video, but I'm hoping Breath of the Wild 2 does like a Banjo... Because banjo 2 sort of deal where... Where basically... Um, all of our experience and the things that we gain and the skills and all that stuff stays with us. Like, I hope we don't have to go through a whole freaking tutorial learning the things that we had already acquired beforehand. Now, I've already said I hope that the Sheikah Slate doesn't play as huge of a role. Like, I would really prefer that we have classic stuff, like real bombs and things like that. But, you can still have the Sheikah Slate and just have it play a different role. Give us new tools with it instead of the same things. And then have Link still have all the skills that he learned from the last game here. Like how Banjo-Tooie does it. Okay, where is this, like... What am I supposed to destroy? This guy? No, my thing's over here. I see it now. Okay, I thought it was a tree, but I couldn't find it earlier. Alright, there. We blocked them out from that side. They totally can't walk around like this. Yeah, it's literally the same... Okay, whatever. Seems kind of stupid, but whatever. Zelda is out. She is gone. She ain't she ain't playing. I bet we could bring down that tree. Yeah, you've mentioned this, Impa. And by we you mean me, don't you? I wanna lock you out just for it. Watch this. See ya, Impa. Alright. Daruk, let's go. It's you and me and this uh Korok, because you know where there's a flower, there's a Korok. Ah, uh, Impa, how'd you get back here? I thought I blocked you. Okay, we got a lot of crates. We're getting a lot of supplies. Why do I feel... I'm just gonna guess, but based off of Breath of the Wild, there's a Lionel in this area, in the Breath of the Wild area in this map. Which, Lionel hunting is like one of the funnest things to do in that game. Just saying like, oh yeah, we're getting a lot of apples. Something's about to go down. 
I don't know what it, it is, but something's about to go down. I'm not really reading everything that they're saying, but I feel like we're about to have something. Protect the princess. Okay, so let's see. I will station me and Daruk. We're going to go out here and take it on. The two of us combined can take him out easy. Slow motion. You know, I gotta land a sm slow motion uh, attack with Daruk. Daruk. The Ice Wizard. I'll make short work of you. away all right there we go Slade get that cash oh, I'm full well here just for the fun of it Slam it. Alright, so... Oh, wait. We just, like, totally ditched the princess. Right, there we go. Who else wants some? I got all the power. Don't mess with me, man. I got all this power. You ain't got nothing. Watch this. Oh, wait. He's an electric type. Oh, God. there we go success that's enough rest for now I apologize for the delay everyone it will be done. all right let's move out there's a lot of water up ahead so watch your step help the princess escape that's not a new objective it's been the whole time the objective Helping her escape and protecting her are basically hand in hand. Okay, camera. Thank you. I wonder if they were wildly used. Okay. Oh, what? You think your magic's better than mine? Guess what? It's not. My magic is uh, complete absolute. And now you die. Boy, that ice power is just OP. I love it. What's going on, Daruk? And where's Elden Impa? 
There's Zelda, there's Imp. Okay. Well, this is our station now, so I feel like we can get a move on. Hey, choo choos. Oh no, I forgot they explode. Come on, guys, let's get a move on. The soldiers are here, they'll deal with it. Alright, y'all do y'all's thing. I'm going over here and taking care of the enemy. Slice them up. Oh, come on. What do I need to do? It says help the princess escape, but she's just staying in that one spot. Okay, there she goes. The way out is just ahead, but no. The road is blocked with trees. See, Impa, you done screwed us over with those trees. You gave the bad guys an idea. They locked us in. It looks similar to Va Ruto's draining mechanism. Perhaps we can use the one little one's power. R2D2, get over here. We need your power. Great work. You're incredible, princess. I mean, I'm the one that did it. Wait a moment. Do you hear something? Oh, boy. It's a Lionel. We about to fight a Lionel. I just feel it. I just feel it. This is where Lionel... Oh, no. Not this guy again. I was really hoping to fight a Lionel. They're fun. This guy's a joke. Yeah, uh, but that hurt, didn't it? Let's do it. Right in the eye. Too easy, too easy. Gotcha. We finished him. He's done. So that's the end of this chapter. Is Pop? Everyone all right? Oh, thank goodness. We're all right because of you, Princess. Your keen senses saved us. Thanks to your strength. Now you listen to me. Uh, okay. You said that you are the only one who can't live up to your potential. But that's completely untrue. I mean, you saved all of us just now. All of your effort, your research, is not in vain, princess. I won't. 
I will fight to fulfill my duty until the very end. Hmm, the lack of Daruk in this cutscene makes me think That's he died. All I can do. Mm-mm. -mm. They didn't show my my Goron friend I selected. Not cool. Just completely cut him out of the scene. Alright. Okay, good. We leveled him up pretty good. He was pretty low. Okay. So is that everything? Or are we going to get like a little thing from the king? For reading the story. Alright, so that is it. Okay. So we finished that off. That's all done and clear. Wrapped up that episode. Successful. Alright, so now... I'm going to end this episode here. Oh, wow, wait a minute. I wonder if this is where, um... I wonder what's going to happen here. Because I wonder, are we going to see any scenes from, like, Breath of the Wild? Like the ceremony that makes Link the Chosen Knight, or whatever it was. Are we going to see that scene? Are we going to see the scenes where the Calamity comes out, and we're going to see it from the perspective of Link, Zelda, and everyone? When Revolvi, like, goes into the air, and he, like, sees the Calamity, and then... Daruk is like, everyone to your divine beast and all that stuff when they were like in this area, I think. Pretty sure it was in this area. I don't really re remember. But I wonder if uh, we're going to see things like that or not. Or if it's all going to be completely unique perspective cutscenes. Anyways, I'm going to end it here and I'll see you all in the next one. See you then.